We got another cop video, man. <laughs> when dirty cops get seduced. Motherfuckers over here mixing business with pleasure, bro. Come with me to my car. Let's see. So let's go. Why are you asking that? Don't fold. Don't fold. Nah, bro was on the camera, he'd fold. If bro is not on the fucking camera getting recorded, he would fucking fold, bro. Wait! Hold on, let me turn my camera off. Let me turn this off real quick. Nah, this nigga's folding, bro. <laughs> yeah, is this nigga about to fucking beat some duties down in the police cruiser? Nah. This is Officer Anthony Hare of the San Diego Police. And on August 14th, 2023, he responded to a call in assisting the arrest of a suspect charged with auto theft. After the arrest, Officer Hare... Bro, what the fuck? This bitch got the body of fucking Humpty Dumpty, my nigga. Did he really fucking fold? ...was put responsible for taking the suspect to the police headquarters and later to the Las Colinas Detention Center. But as your witness, Anthony had some other plans in mind with the suspect. Nah, this nigga's cooked. Loki respected you still got jailed. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. Fucking your suspect and then fucking putting them in jail is crazy work. Listen to him. Put your hands behind your back. Why are you guys tripping like that? I can't hold Just listen, bro. It's not that hard. Man, I ain't gonna lie. If I'm ever in a situation like this, bro, I'm listening to everything the cops fucking say, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> Nigga, I'm not trying to die. What the fuck? Should I, what'd you do if you was a cop and you had to arrest Ice Spice? Shit, I gotta, I, I gotta do my job, bro. Bitch gotta go behind bars. Not risking my job. Yeah, maybe it's easy. Roll, roll over first, yeah. Roll over. That bitch might cast like some demonic spell on me. Y'all be seeing how she's like in the media right now with like being satanic and like demonic and shit like that? That's just been on my Twitter. After detaining the suspect, Officer Hare called in for the unnamed suspect's warrant and then moved on to questioning her. Hi, it's Officer Hare at San Diego. This freak ass AI voice. Confirm a warrant. Uh, Officer Hare? H A I R. Epilepsy warning. The fuck am I talking about? Ice Spice and her fucking demonic ways. What's up, Sycopotamus? Stratus, when's the face reveal? Yo, nigga, are you fucking stupid? What do you mean when's the face reveal? Anthony was put in charge of taking the female suspect to the headquarters, mm. while the others were in charge of the male suspect. Ah, oh, shit! As soon as Anthony and the female suspect were left alone, that's when things started getting fishy. Nah, she tried to risk her way out this shit. Perfect. Just a little bit more. 
passing that. Bro, and just think this nigga's logs got fucking leaked, nigga. Like, damn, bro. You're cooked. What do you mean? I'm cool to you. On the ride to the headquarters, the suspect continued to make flirty remarks towards Officer Hare. Ah, damn. When he was charged with taking her to the detention center, that's when things truly got kicked up a notch. Oh shit. Can I ask if you're single or not? Oh shit. She gonna say who even who even said that? Imagine bro recording the whole scene on camera. <laughs> Can you hear me? Well, I can't hear you now. I'm down to fuck right now. Don't say that right now. No, I said don't say that right now. It's Yo, it's so crazy how so how motherfuckers stoop to that level. Just to get out of a situation. Like motherfuckers is down to give to, to fucking give out pussy. Just to get out of a situation, bruh. Yeah, she's trying to get dicked down. I don't even think she's trying to get dicked down. She's just trying to get out of this situation with a with a lighter sentence. Cause she knows she did something wrong. After making a direct remark and engaging in certain activities, Officer Hare tried to play it off for the body cam. What do they mean by and engaging in certain activities? Did this bitch start fucking fingering herself in the back of the police cruiser? That's insane. Tried to play it off for the body cam. To add on to that, he pretended like there might be something wrong with the suspect as to give him an excuse to quote, unquote, check up on her. Hey, you doing good back there? Yo, this nigga can't stand his fucking ground, bruh. She on the type of the, uh, to get that shit out for free, hell yeah. She's giving it to a fucking random cop. Nigga, you already know her pussy is fucking infested. Are you doing good back there? Are you doing good back there? Sorry, you can send somebody to the problem with the narrow address. Uh, you just arrived. Nigga, you need to take her to that goddamn uh detention facility. <clears throat> Eventually, Officer Hare turns off his body cam. But his cruiser was still tracked by the police department, which shows that he turned into a residential area. But in all of this, Officer Hare made one crucial mistake. Turns out he ended up getting himself locked in the cruiser. And had to call for help just 20 minutes after which raised a lot of suspicion. Wait, am I a dumbass? How the fuck did he get locked inside his own fucking car? What? Am I hearing this right? Officer Hare made one crucial mistake. Turns out he ended up getting himself locked in the cruiser. And had to call for help just 20 minutes after which raised a lot of suspicion. How the fuck did you get locked in your own fucking car? Nigga, what? And not only did you turn off the camera, which is gonna raise suspicion, you took a whole different scenic route. Like, and, and you didn't even know you were being tracked? Oh, this nigga was in the back seat! Don't tell me the nigga got locked in the back seat! This nigga got caught! Nah! That nigga's freaked out! Nah, I ain't gonna lie. That nigga's heart dropped. 
Oh, I know his fucking heart was in his fucking ass when I right, sir step out the car for me. Nigga, you can't even talk to me like like a police officer. Nigga, I'm just sorry to you. That's crazy. One fourteen yellow. We're code four. Okay, hold on, hold on, let me turn my camera off. She's code four? She's code four. Okay, okay. Yeah, let me turn this off real quick. You mind just showing us? The next day, he was asked to reenact what happened. Additionally, both Officer Hare and the suspect were interviewed separately. And then, do you want me to see how she was laying down, or? How you got, how you ended up inside. So, like, yeah, so she, so she was laying down, her face was over there. And then I was just like kind of right here. I was like, hey, well, at first I was like, hey, wake up. I was like, hey, are you okay? Blah, blah, blah. She did like, so her head was facing towards that way. And then so this is when I, I was shaking her. And then this is when I went in. But then I, I, I don't know if I had my hand like this. And then. Time out. Is bro giving a breakdown of how he's beating the, 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 the fucking goonies down? See how she was laying down. Or... Okay, okay. So, yeah, let me turn this off real quick. You mind just showing us? The next day he was asked to reenact what happened. Additionally, both Officer Hare and the suspect were interviewed separately. And then, do you want me to see how she was laying down? Or, uh, how you got, how you ended up inside? So, like, yeah, so she, so she was laying down, her face was over there. And then I was just, like, kind of right here. I was like, well, at first I was like, hey, wake up. I was like, hey, are you okay? Blah, blah, blah. She Nigga, lying like she shit. That way. And then so this is when I, I was shaking her. And then this is when I went in. But then I, I, I don't know if I had my hand like this. And then... Nah, nigga showing how he got inside the fucking pussy. That nigga, nah, fuck that, bro. Nigga talking about some, yeah, I uh, I opened the car right here and then I like got inside shit and then the car just like, damn, and then I was in that big bop 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 type shit. Like nigga wasn't even talking about that. Like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Okay. Yeah. And then, so yeah, I was, I was like this. And then, when I found out the door was clicked behind me, I positioned myself like this. And I already knew that there was no door handle, but I was just like frantic. I was like, I can't get out of here. Okay. And then that's when she was, I, she was able to sit up here. Nah, bro. I thought her you could stay there. I ain't gonna lie. When Buddy said he turned the camera off, bro, cooked. I know what you were doing. You're not slick. Down like this on okay. my side. So, so uh, let, let me go to the other side. Then you climb back oh, in. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Again. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, um, open the door, and then as I came in like that, I was, you know, I was trying to wake her up. My feet wasn't this way, my feet didn't get caught like that. And then when I was like waking her up, that's when I noticed that this door closed on me. And then that's when I was like frantic trying to open the door, but I know there's no, okay. there no door opener. And Nigga lying like shit. She was, able, um, she was able to, so I was like, I was like this majority of the time. I was trying to, you know, get her up because her face was right here. Okay. Right here, and then I was trying to, like... Bro, all I... I just can't believe this nigga really just fucked some random suspect that he fucking saw. Like, not even a whole... Not even, like... Nigga just met the bitch! Like, not even fucking ten minutes into knowing the bitch. You're already fucking her. Like, what, bro? And then... Next you know, nigga... Nigga need me to teach him how to lie for real? And then, she, and then that's when she started to kind of, like, I guess, wake up or get dazed off. Whatever. And then that's when I asked her, like, hey, are you having a hard time breathing? She said, no. Do you need medics? No. I was like, okay, all right. Just, just stay right there. And then that's when I was <laughs> trying to open the door. Okay. And then that's when I went on D2. All right. You can jump up. Let's jump up. Explain to me, Tony, how is it that you got all the way into the car with her laying down? It, it, it was her up. It was like I was trying to um, get her up because she, she was a heavy girl. Okay. So I was trying to, like, lift her up to sit okay. her down. Okay. And then, but yes, it was a it was a tight squeeze in there. So then I think that's how somehow maybe my leg. Because that means that your 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 torso 
your butt, your legs, and your feet are completely inside the car. Yeah, I was kind of like, I can. Sh uh, I wish I could show you if you were in the patrol car. But okay. yeah, I was. I was in there. Well, like, bro, the law don't even make no sense, bro. And the other cop or whoever's uh, investigating this nigga caught on so fast, cause nigga. You don't got to get your whole body in there to wake the bitch up and see if she's okay, right? Like, you know what I'm saying, bro? Strat, did this before? I have not done this before, bro. But it's just, it's just not likely, bro. No, so that his whole body was in that bitch? Or that he needed his whole body in that bitch? And then somehow through hitting the door, meaning when you kind of push it to open it, it kind of rebounds and close back on you? Correct, yes. Is that what you're saying? You Correct, think that? Yes. But that means that nigga had to swing the door so fucking hard to where it, it, it bounces back and closes. But that nigga's not going to be doing that. Story, Tony, and I want to make sure if there was something that you forced her, if she consented and said, hey, there's going to be, I'll do this, or you do that, you know, we can have a good time there, if there's there a there consent was, she did not or say something like you forced her, yourself on her. She, she did not say anything like, hey, if I do this for you, let me go. She, she did not... And even if she did say something like that, I would, I would. Nah, that's where you're caught, buddy. And even if she did, nigga, you're done, buddy. She, she did not. And even if she did say something like that, I would, I would, I, I believe I just. If, if she, if she said, if she said something and you said, hey, don't say that right now because it's recording. Mm -hmm. You remember that? I. Caught in four fucking K. Oh my god! Oh yeah! Put the fries in the bag! You're cooked, buddy! I, she, she, I remember her saying something like, hey, I'm on right now because. Whatever. I'm on what? I'm on what? what? What do you mean? Oh, like my, my camera thing. I think I did. I mentioned because I don't know. Mm -hmm. I, there was one thing where she said, um, mm -hmm. I don't know if it was like. I don't know if it was talking with a family issue or whatever or. She, she, Nigga, family issue? She said she wanted the fuck! You're asking if I was single, but. but that was the only thing was like, yeah, you know, I'm recording right now. That's it, but... Okay, so... Niggas cook. Hold on, click that link real quick. What's this, Ryan? The nigga swung his... Yo! And that's how... Yo! That's how niggas describing the... Hey, bro, I just... You know, like, I just put my leg up here, and then, like... I somehow just ended up like this type shit. Like, like, uh, dude. Um, comment and you were to say something like, hey, don't say that right now. It's recording or, um, it's, you know, you don't remember that, you're saying. Because I just talked to you about all that and you said no. But I could tell you for a fact. No, I mean, I, I remember saying something like that that I'm on. Not that you mentioned it because I didn't. And what did she did. say? What did she say? To that, that I don't remember. I would, have to look, I would have to look at my, my DWC again to, to see what exactly she said. That I promise I don't remember what she said. He was like, um, well, he, well, he said something like, he said, so are you single or are you with your boyfriend, your boyfriend right there or something like that? Like, I don't know, I took it, like, I don't remember how to take it. So he asked you if you were single? Yeah, I don't know. I don't remember how to, how to take it. I kind of like laughed a bit off. I was just like, Oh, she knows that she got She knows she got fucked And she knows that she just got that nigga in trouble She got fucked and he got fucked What the hell, how is it after that? I don't remember what words he was saying I don't remember what we were talking about I swear I don't remember what we were saying And I do, but I do remember Like, um Him, um Like he I think he might have used an excuse just to come in to the back. Because he says, he says he's going to come in the back because, I mean, it would have, have to happen that way because I don't know why he's like, so that he thought that wasn't breathing right or something. Yo, just say you asked the nigga to fuck and he did it. You're not going to get in trouble. He's going to get in trouble. Like, because, um, I was laying down, and he said he came to the back. It was really with my officers after, and um, I think he might, have, he might have used an excuse to get back there with me, but he didn't want to say. I mean, obviously he knows he didn't want to say anything that would get him in trouble, and so um, he opens the back door, he gets out, opens the back door, and then like he says that the door shut, and I don't, I don't know. 
I think it was just stupid. You said you believe to use that as an excuse to get into the back seat. What do you believe was the reason why he was getting in the back seat? I mean, it's kind of just like only like it could only be like one other thing. Like, you know, why? Why else would anybody do that? You know? and, um, I don't know if um he was scared. And Getting juicy. He knew he fucked up. And he was scared, and then. I remember him. Um, when you say he knew he fucked up, because he, he closed the door behind him on okay. accident. Okay. Because and then I was like, oh my god! So I remember I was like, what the fuck? Like, and he started panicking. He started getting. He started panicking, and he was like, oh my god. So I just got a question: Did my nigga hit? Yes or no? Imagine doing all that. You ain't even hit my nigga. Like, right, bro, what the fuck? And then um, like, he called one of his friends. So he called somebody on the wow. So he called another um, officer and they came to open the door for him. Mm -hmm. Oh, brother did hit. And then I went to the um, to the hospital afterwards because when they got to ask me, as they said, I, um, they sent me to the hospital and that was it. Mm -hmm. So did he make any sexual propositions at that tribe at all? Again, this is the one where you're going no. to. Yeah, no. No sexual. Uh, um, did you make any comments or sexual propositions to him during that transport? No. Does it say anything? I don't know. I don't think so. I don't. Oh, my God, bro. Okay. Um, do you remember engaging into conversations that were sexual in nature or some or some might think there was sexual in nature during what that drive? What's that? What like if... Uh, Yo, they both pissing me off, bro. You and him had a conversation and comments were made that someone might listening might interpret like, well, were they talking about sex or was it? Oh, or, no. You know, is anything that someone might think. Think about sex? No. Think about sexual comments or sexual stuff like that. No. Okay. Okay. Although both denied taking part in any frugal activities, a further investigation revealed traces of semen on Officer Hare's belt. With that discovery, he resigned from the force. Corrupt cops like these are- OH NAH! GG's pal! OH NAH!